Hey, this is Matt here with the No Baggage Challenge for Charity. I'm traveling in Japan for 10 days with no bags, only Scotty Vest clothing. Um, and in exchange for uh, testing out their clothes and putting them through a, a really rigorous test of travel in a you know, highly industrial, clean, kind of fancy country like Japan, Scotty Vest is going to be making a donation of at least $1,500 to a charity I support, Students for a Free Tibet. Uh, I'm right now, I'm at the Renoji Temple in uh, Nikko, Japan. It's about two hours uh, northeast by train from Tokyo. Uh, we came up to Nikko last night uh, from Kyoto on a, a series of trains. It was three different trains. Uh, two of them were the Shinkansen, which are the high-speed bullet train rail. Um, incredibly fast, really clean and nice and new. One of the things I'd read about the Shinkansen before coming here was that you know you had to watch out because you traveled so fast you could have your ears pop and for some people it's actually very painful to travel on. Um, while I did have some popping of ears on the trip it was actually really nice not a big deal at all um, just incredible views of mountains all the way up from Kyoto to Tokyo and then changed the trains a couple times and we're now in Nikko which is in, in the mountains up here. Um, so far the trip is really going great. Um, I was obviously a little concerned about whether or not wearing the same two t-shirts and uh, the same two pairs of pants and tops for 10 days straight would hold up. I've been doing a lot of walking around every day. We're basically just walking from 9 in the morning till at least you know, 8 or 9 at night. Um, and you know, definitely uh, when it's been hotter out, I've been sweating a little. So I was very concerned about how the clothes would hold up. And um, so far, washing them every night and taking two showers a day has basically been totally fine. I, you know, I, I, the clothes don't smell, I don't smell, uh, no one who I'm traveling with has complained about uh, how I smell, so I think it's just a really great success. The other thing that's been really great is that I'm traveling with three people, my parents and my girlfriend Lori, who's shooting this video. Each of them have a, you know, a small suitcase, carry-on size, for 10 days of clothes. Um, I'm traveling with just the carry-on coat, which I'm not wearing now, but can have all the extra stuff I'm carrying, including an iPad, extra pair of pants, button-down shirt, extra t-shirt, and so on. Um, walking around through train stations with just the carry-on coat on has been really easy and relaxing. The train stations in Japan are very crowded, and um, you know there can be a lot of weaving through traffic if you will, with suitcases. I've avoided that completely, though I will say I am helping my mom and girlfriend carry their luggage down big flights of stairs, so I'm not a jerk. Um, but the point being, the traveling with no bags has been really freeing, it's really light, I feel like I, you know, the clothes have done what I've needed them to do, um, and I'm, I'm just really happy with how it's all working out. And again, not smelling is a really big plus, so very happy with that. Um, we are in the seventh day of our trip. Um, we head to Tokyo tonight, and it's been the last uh, two and a half days in Tokyo. And then it's back to the States. Um, everything's gone great. I'm going to have another update uh, later this week. Thanks for watching. Please share this video. Um, and uh, let me know if you have any questions or comments. Cheers.